Lateral epicondylitis, also known as tennis elbow, presents with pain at the lateral epicondyle, which is the insertion point of the common extensor tendon. It is important to recognize that this is often not due to an elbow problem, but rather can be due to repetitive activities involving wrist extension. Steroid injections are quite helpful, but are generally not the long-term solution. Identify the point of maximal tenderness. This is usually slightly anterior to the lateral epicondyle over the common extensor tendon, particularly that part formed by the extensor carpi radialis brevis muscle. Use a retractable pen to mark the point of maximal tenderness. These injections should always be done using sterile technique. Scrub the site of injection and then clean in an outward fashion. Here I am using a mixture of 2% chlorhexidine and 70% isopropyl alcohol. Local anesthetic can be applied initially or a mixture of steroid and local anesthetic can be applied at once. Here I have a mixture of 40 mg of Depometrol mixed with 2% xylocaine and I am using a 25 gauge 5 8 inch needle. I used 0.5 mL of 80 mg per mL Depometrol and 0.5 mL of 2% xylocaine for a total volume of 1 mL. Using your mark, advance the needle down to bone and then withdraw just a little. Always aspirate to ensure you are not in a blood vessel. Then inject the solution. This should go in fairly freely. Finish off by drying the site and applying a bandage.